the comments required for this experiment are node mc board mq135 gas sensor dst11 temperature sensor connecting cable and connecting wires Now log into the thingspeak.com website. Here enter the email address and click on next button and here we need to enter the password. Now click on the sign in button. Now click the new channel button and create a new channel. I am giving the channel name as Air Quality Monitoring. Here we are going to create three fields, temperature, humidity and gas. So we need to click on three check boxes next to the field names. So the text boxes will be enabled. And here we need to enter the field name. First one is temperature, second one is humidity. The add one is the gas. And now click save channel. Now three widgets are added. One for temperature, second one for humidity and the third one for gas. So if you want we can add more widgets. So now click on add widgets and we can also add the gauge widgets. So we need to add three gauge widgets. and here field 1. Before that we can click on the edit button for of this uh, text uh, of this widget and here we need to enter the field name temperature and enter the maximum value as 100. Minimum value will be 0 and click on save button and similar like the second one click on edit button and here enter the name as humidity and the maximum value was 100 minimum value was 0 and click on the save button do the same for the third one gas now add two more uh, gauge widgets since we already added one First one for temperature, and select the field name, and enter the unit unit as Celsius, and click on the create button. And second one will be the gauge widget for humidity, and field two, and the unit will be in percentage. Again click on create button and now create that third one. This one is for gas value and the field will be the third field. And the unit is in ppm. Okay. We can also drag and uh, arrange this widget. So the first one is for temperature. Here humidity. So we can drag this humidity here and the one is for gas value. Now go to API keys and copy this API key and paste in our program. So here this is the API key and then we need to enter the Wi-Fi username and Wi-Fi password. So here everything is done. Now we need to upload the program to the node MCU board. So for that select the board from tools 
board ESP8266 and select node MC1.0 and then select the port. Now click this arrow button and upload the program to the node MC board. Now the program is uploaded and we can check the output. So this is the output from the ThingSpeak website.